And hello, 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 and welcome back with some more Crusader Kings 2 Horse Lords Yuga Fun. And just waiting, waiting basically. That's all I've been doing. I've been waiting until I can declare invasions of places. Because I can't quite do that yet. Because my population isn't quite high enough, but it is getting there. Oh, horse breed has been built, so that should increase the armor of all my soldiers, of all my great warriors. Um, oh, sorry, in fixes, um, improves their defense. Okay, close enough, close enough. Riding contests. Oh, some of them are very good. What about, a, <coughs> what about a yam? Because trade post limit one, economic technology points. Yes, please. I'm going to exact a lot of tribute. Exact all the tribute. Oh, nearly can. Nearly can. Just, just need to increase that a bit more. How are they going in their little war against the Karkoblids anyway? Mm, only 39 in his favor. Now it's dropped down to 38. He's got a lot of troops though. So if he catches his main armies in the field, he should win without too, without too many issues. He just hits up to 50 percent. Ooh, that's a bigger army though. He's going to struggle against that. Move these blokes over here in preparation. I'm loving this whole population thing though. I think that's pretty awesome. Love the feature. Yes, we can declare... We can, we can invade Cumania and take it for us. So, we're going to do that right away, without hesitation. And we're going to crush their armies. Um, of course, they'll honor the call. Finally, we invade Yugra. I'm not sure if they, um, these provinces then just become... Um, what are they called again? What are we using? <laughs> I can't remember. Not sure if they become these particular landless holdings then, as a result. I hope they do. We'll find out. I think he tried to bite off a bit more than he could chew. Oh, wait a second, did he beat their army? He did. Wow, I have no idea how he pulled that off, but, you know, you kind of got to admire that. Should I build those extra... Uh, actually, I might keep those extra manpower in reserve for later. What type of land is all that, anyway? The land is... Step, step... Arctic. Arctic! Okay, Arctic. Step. Step. Forest. Arctic. Step. Some of it is step, some of it isn't. So, but steps are the best. Ooh, I'm losing men, aren't I? And I'm losing a few. So we're going to divide our forces. Wait a second. If he can get to there, 26th of April. I'd rather not lose troops from attrition if I can avoid it. 2nd of May. 7th of May. So we send them down here, then we move them like that. I hope... Ugh, geez, that's... Is it because of the time of year? Yes, it is because of the time of year. And because of different religion. I did not think this one for... Um... <laughs> I completely forgot about that. This is going to be interesting. To say the least. I've already copped attrition as well. Ah, I did not think about that. At all. That's gone up to 762, at least it's slightly higher. Oh, he actually won that. Wow, I'm impressed. Good, good for him. He's going to send his forces over here now, though. You know what? I just want to get these guys in the pitch battle. If I can get them in a pitch battle, I'll be alright. Send our forces north. We're going to take the casualties, back. <laughs> we're just going to take the casualties. I think that's what we're going to do. He'll get there 5th of July. He'll get there... 
23rd of June. I'm gonna take the casualties pretty much. 4%, that's not terrible, 6%. So, basically attrition casualties, because we're invading, um, another place with, like, another religion. Um, well, I really wish they didn't go into that province then, but they did. We should win that battle even with those troops just by themselves. Because we've got much better troops. Well, if you're keen on that, you know, yeah, that's cool. By the way, why haven't these guys jumped in? Oh, there's a new Kagan of the Kyrgyz. Because they had some of their territory annexed by the Ugra, and they had some of their territory annexed by the Kakalods. And they also had some of theirs annexed by the Mongols. We defeat their main army here, we've basically won the war. Yeah, that boosts up to 62. Can we ransom this guy for 70 gold? Yes, we can. Send these troops to follow them. They've all honored the call to war as well, as I thought they would. Let him rot. We've only just got him. Yeah, they're all obligating the calls to war. Betrothed can marry. Well, let's get that done then. We've used up a lot of our manpower. Um, that should go up pretty quickly again though. So it's alright, we'll be able to build it back up. That's an 84 now. Oh, they're not copying attrition there. That is good. So that's slightly higher, so I'm going to move them down there instead. No, I'm not going to move them there. I'm going to move them here. If we just siege their capital and take it. That's the war one. They've nearly taken that as well. See, that goes up... That actually goes up pretty quick. Um, once, you've, once you've actually... The, like, the lower your troop numbers are, basically, the quicker it pops up kind of thing, if that makes sense. They've nearly taken that. And that's war score. That is victory. Victory against the Ugra. It's a bit of a funky looking realm now, but it'll do. Um... He's actually a full-on vassal. He's not an actual as well. Um, he's an actual count. Or oh, sorry, he's a chief. Okay. Interesting. Inefficient land management. Damn, we should take a more territory, I think. Um, we've got a random new little... Is that like a barony of some sort? Do, 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 do. We could always just give the actual titles to some random guy in my court. As well. This guy hates me. He thinks I'm a dick. I'm pretty, tempted, I'm pretty tempted just to try kill him off, actually. And then his provinces will become split. Yeah, let's do that. Um, <laughs> Auto invite plotters. Hopefully, they join in for the fun. Hmm. Well, at least we've conquered the territory. Good. Now, I'm thinking, how do we destroy the, tri the tribe of Tura? <sighs> no, that's not what I want to do. Ugh, titular cognate of Yuga. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure this out. I 
Oh, there you go. Trouble lands of turret. Okay, you're not going to let me click on like that. Ugh. County of Tura. Destroy this. Can't destroy counties or baronies, but I don't want it. <laughs> I'm going to give it to a random in my court. It doesn't really matter who I give it to, as long as they're keen for the idea. The Adiz. Digging his hat. His hat's pretty cool. What about this guy? Is he Pechenegg? You know what? I'm just going to give this guy the title, so he stops being a dick. Um, you can have it. Clan wants my lands. You hold too much land compared to other clans. Hand out one county, or you might face revolts from the existing clans as it negatively affects your clan settlement of you. You can face a minor clan rising revolt to seize the rightful position among the major clans. So, I believe there was something over here that can increase my clan management, though. Um... Ooh, Shrine increased my population growth. Good. I'm trying to think of which one I need to use to increase it. I saw it earlier. Clan Gathering Hall. Well, that will increase it. Clan Settlement. I can settle as a tribe, can I? Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to try this guy killed off, and then as a result, try all his sons killed off. <laughs> um, and get the land settled. As I said, don't entirely... Ooh, now known as the Victorious. Yeah! That's awesome. Hmm, I'm trying to think. Hmm, what should I do? Have people joined the plot yet? Yeah, the whole bunch of people. They all want him dead. Um, use 26 gold for that. You know what, I'll just release the rest. They can be released. They've got 92 on him. If we can do that, we can then divide up all his crap. Um, how old's his son? And they've got to um, build that back up to full strength. It'll take a bit of time. Manpower of 67 a month currently. That's alright. Upgrading my clan settlement. That'll get done soon. Ooh, one education. Um, educate child. Do, 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 do. Kaboom! Khan Uge, my co-conspirator, sent word that a massive pit of manure has been prepared under the floorboards of an abandoned inn on a path. Chief Miller will travel with his escort once they... Ooh, kaboom. <laughs> Sounds pretty evil. And he got these back up to full strength as well. Ooh, my population growth's gone up. 15,000. Success. Chief blah, 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 has perished in the manure explosion. <laughs> it's a manure explosion. That's awesome. Um, there is no trace of my complicity to be found amongst the rubble. Oh. So now... Yeah, I'm pretty skilled. I just did that. Do, 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 do. I should have conquered more territory. Should have attacked more territory and taken it physically, because then I would have got it myself. Um, didn't think about that though. If I turn this guy, if I actually turn this guy, um, I'm curious. 
I get him educated to such an extent. No, no, you won't do it. He's been stubborn. Negative 100. Well, if you don't like me, you're kind of a dick. Um, none of them like me. They think I'm a jerk, basically. So, we're going to have this kid killed. We're going to have this kid killed as well. Oh, I can only do one plot at a time, though. So, um, yeah. Do, 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 do. We probably should have taken more provinces then. I think that was part of the problem. Um, did my clan man? Did my clan management building finish? Did it? It did. Wait a second. No, it didn't. It's being built now. Clan gathering hall. That will do clan settlement of plus two. So that will help it. Got a decent amount of money coming in as well. Zero dot ninety. I do have a few vassals, who, for the most part, hate me. Um, this guy thinks I'm alright, though. I gave him a random barony of the rule. Gave this guy the tribal lands as well, so I'll be able to call upon him for war. Well, he's kind of a dick to me, but then, you know, I just gave him the territory. <coughs> that would do. So, how many people um, are in the plot to have this kid killed? Abandon heresy? No, I won't do that. So I do have a few vassals. I can have a few vassals floating around. That's alright. That's okay. Okay, my technology is slightly going up now, apparently. Nomads do not generate technology points from buildings. So, okay, that confuses me a little bit then. So, that's not going up. That's just... Not going up at all. Um, mum, I'm confused. Or it's going to go up really s slowly. You can press the Jure claims. He's my, still my tributary, tributary isn't he? Your son is of age. Well, good. Can I send this guy for the mercenary bands yet? No, apparently not. Do, 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 do. Oh, my co conspirator. Yeah, I can send you some money. It's alright. Oh, he's now the heir, is he? Okay, well, as long as one of my sons is, that's all good. Um, what's his stats like? He's fortune builder, greedy, mm, not great. This guy's much better. He hasn't knocked up his misses yet. Failure. Um, damn it, I'm gonna have to try again. I just remember one time um, when I was a bit, when I was ruling as a Byzantine ruler, and the current ruler I was playing as, um, I think he was, he was, he was a kid. They, had, they tried to kill him like six, seven times and they kept failing. And the guy who kept doing it actually eventually went insane from it. It was pretty funny. Here's the new commander. Can we get him to go research military technology? Yeah, we can. Collect tribute. Amazing, why didn't I oversee construction? Um, searching, uh, process size. Uh, it's pretty difficult to get them converted. Ah, clan management hall. So, clan wants more land. Clan settlement, hand out 1Ks, or you might face revolts. But not just do the clan gathering hall thing. Shouldn't, isn't that supposed to increase my clan management? So that still stays there. Okay. Oh, they have a blood feud, do they? <laughs> so 
So you're basically telling me, okay, oh, here it is, number of clans. No, current clans is three out of three. Nomadic counties in realm, 12 desired counties per clan. Clan, clan land demand. The, can, the Khan holds too much land compared to other clans. He has to hand out one county or might face revolts. So what I might even do is, I might find some random guy in my court, like so. Um, how much is that? Like 17, 15,000. My cousin. I'm going to give my cousin a clan, basically. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just give it to him. Screw it. Um, County of Tura. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give it to my cousin. Because he seems like a cool guy. If he tries to screw me over, I'm going to be really pissed off, though. Um... County of Turo, he can rule. Wait a second, is this oh, is this steps over here? It's desert apparently. Is this steps? Oh, okay, well I'm probably better better off giving him that province. Sorry, uh, actually no, I'll keep it. I kind of like it. Um, give that to the cars. County of Turo. Now I no longer have those issues. These guys are not gonna be pissed off. Wait a second, this guy's got like six this guy's got six. That guy's got like I've got like four. Three. He's got more than me. <laughs> um don't know how that works. Anyway that. It's so good, and that'll probably do for now. Um, hope you all enjoyed yourselves as per usual. If you enjoyed, subscribe, and as always, bye bye.